I, I really feel that this is a day to celebrate Israeli society and Israeli culture. It's like our one day of the year when we can soak up Israeli energy, Israeli love, Israeli music, Israeli food. It's Israel's day in America, certainly in LA. And, and I think in the, it was, it was never meant to be a Jew, a day to celebrate necessarily Judaism. It was the day of celebrating one of the great expressions of Judaism today, which is the state of Israel. So I think Judaism is sort of intertwined naturally. Judaism is intertwined naturally into the day. You'll see there's Chabad, they're putting on tefillin, and there's all kinds of great Jewish organizations, but there's no doubt that this is a day to uh, celebrate Israeli culture. Uh, what do you think about the presence of Christian supporters for Israel here? You know, it's funny, I've not noticed them uh, today, but look, you know, there's a huge amount of support among the, the Christian population. Uh, from what I heard in the evangelical world, there's like 50 million, you know, unconditional supporters of Israel. Uh, we have so many enemies in this world. As far as I'm concerned, the more friends, the better. Jewish Journal did a big uh, a promo. How are you involved with the event? We're involved strictly in terms of journalism. So it's a big deal. They advertise with us. We Every year we do a story ahead of it. And we just we cover it because it's a major story. What does it mean for the city to have such a, a presence? Could we have an event like this? Or, or could uh, other cities like Paris or London have such a free open expression of Zionism? Well, I think it's a good question. Uh, it, it's really a day that sort of speaks to the freedom that we have here in America to be who we are. I think it's a compliment to American democracy, the way America has embraced the Jews, the way we're equal under the law. And one of the great love affairs between the Jews and America, this is an expression of that, the way that here we are, you know, uh, seven decades after the Holocaust and losing six million of our own and celebrating with, you know, 20,000 Jews here in America celebrating the Jewish state. I think it speaks to the great experience of the Jews in America.